Well, hello everyone and welcome back to RimWorld. I hope you're all well. This is the perfect vanilla experience, as we mentioned before. Now, today we've got to get focused on getting this part of the wall done. We need to get some more food ready, because as you can see, we are starting to cook our meals up now, but we only have a little bit of raw meat. And uh, I realise what I've done here. So I've got this cooler on minus 10 here, but it does make this room... At the moment it's okay, but if we get hit by a heat wave although we will be into autumn soon, then this room will be a problem. So we may need to factor that in. I'm going to let de Blasi do a bit of hunting here. But guys, thank you so much for the love on the videos. It really, really is appreciated. So I do... I can't thank you enough for that, really. So we're going to harvest some of these. And uh, yeah, because I know it can be... I don't know. I think I'm not like a massive noob at the game, to be fair, because I've played similar games, so it's not horrendous. Good shot, de Blasi. So yeah, I do appreciate that. And obviously your tips are awesome. And yeah, if there are mods that you are familiar with and that you think are good, quality of life mods, some crazy mods I don't mind, like just do do tell me about them as well because I do want to mod this game and play it. Obviously, I'll only keep playing if, if it's wanted on the channel. But back to it. Hopefully, you can kill this and we'll get a bit more meat. We'll harvest that as well. And what I want to do is set up a food storage room. So that's going to be one thing we do. Now, we do have this with the... Uh, I don't know how to do it with our layout. With our freezer here, what we should do is kind of airlock it, almost. Because at the moment, the heat is going to come from this room. At the moment, it's okay. It does get through these walls, though. It makes this room a little bit cooler. But I do want to basically set up a food store room that is attached to this. But what I'm going to do is actually build it in a way. Let's get a proper... I'm guessing... Well, I say guessing. What's going to be the best for heat transfer? I imagine some kind of stone. So let's go sandstone wall here. And what we're going to do is actually airlock this baby. So we'll do something like that. And then we'll put in a sandstone door times two. And then this will eventually be upgraded in sandstone. I know that is a mod. that I might enable that. I know I said vanilla, but I might enable the to be able to just change the walls and stuff like that. But yeah, this is going to be a storeroom. Now, we do still have some wood to work with, so we are going to utilize that here. But I'm going to go basically build some shelving units in here. I'm not sure how big to do it. But this is going to be... Uh, no, 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 hold on. I'm doing... Let me cancel all this. This isn't what I want to do. This isn't what I want to do. We want a general storage, actually. I'm talking absolute rubbish. So, where do we want the general storage is a, a good question. I think possibly over here, then, or over here. As long as it can come into this, I'm not too fussed. A general storage. Let's go... This isn't staying here. Let's go here. Let's get our structure going. This can be wood for now, then. So, I'm going to have a two gap here. All right, we're going to have to reinstall our uh, our throwy thing, actually. So let's move that up as well, because we put our storeroom straight on top of it. I've actually uh, stopped and, and just rearranged this a tiny bit. So, And I've got these guys moving stuff over. So that's what we're going to do. We've got the little shelves. I think we'll go with that size. So I kind of trimmed it a tiny bit, but that's, that's okay. That's what we're going with. All right, I do want to hunt a tiny bit here as well. So I think we're going to hunt you. Uh, not going to bother with the guinea pig. There are some ibexes here. I don't know how the taming kind of works. We do need to test that bad boy out. I might give it a go once we've got maybe a little fence up, actually. So let's go um, structures here. We could build a fence around. Now, we need somewhere which could hold the animals in a safe spot. I reckon we could go up here. Now, how big do we want our animal pen? I might be doing a little bit too much early on, but I think it's okay. Um, and we'll get a wooden fence gate, wooden gate just installed in here, probably. Maybe one over here as well. All right, I've just noticed we do have a raid. If you noticed, I've given Coburn the knife, actually. So I checked his bio. I did this kind of wrong, didn't I? I've actually got him on the knife because his melee's at four and he, he actually levels it up. So they are attacking immediately. So we're going to need to grab these guys. He's got no armor. So I am going to draft both of these and we're going to bring them in. And we're going to get them set up over here. Nice and quick. Come back to Blasi. What I'm going to do is grab Coburn, kind of hide him in there. Oh, no, we're not. All right, let's hide him. Hopefully, he can hit a shot here. 
Please, de Blasi, hit your shot. Alright, I can get him to attack. Like that. Yeah, knife him. He's got no armor on, so this should be good. Oh, nice and easy. Well done, guys. Okay, yeah, getting that melee weapon is kind of important. I think... Ben, can you... Alright, we need to get an enclosure here. Mm. Prison bed? Let's check his bio. Let's see if he's worth it for now. So, let's go in. Intellectual 12. Crafting 9. We don't have anyone with crafting. That could be good. Let's turn this into a prisoner bed. And let's get Ben to capture you. Now, this might be early on doing this, but that's okay. And we've got an Ambrosia Sprout here. I'm going to leave that. I'm not even sure what they do. Ambrosia Bush. Something we might be able to harvest, so that's cool. But yeah, we got a lot of building to do, so I need to get Coburn on that almost. Um, we can allow this, and he's got a little bit of silver we'll allow as well. And let's get some of these medical roots. And what we're going to do is make sure Ben is on the warden, which he is. So he's going to warden up before doing research. That's perfect. And yeah, we can get Zeif on a weapon as well. I'd like to uh, get them all decent melee weapons. What are we researching at the moment? Ah, we're in on the solar panel. That's cool. So we will keep that. Um, we're going to need another bed, though. So let's focus on a sleep bed for someone. We might just need to share a room for now. But I think that's okay. Uh, Coburn. What construction does he have? Oh, yes. He likes construction, too. This, Yeah, he's a good character. Although I didn't check. Look at him just carrying in a deer. I didn't check what uh, what he has here. Annoying voice. Okay, Night Owl, Iron Willed, and Incapable of Social. No problem. Okay, Burn. I know you're resting, but you're quite happy. Can you just build that bed for our friend here? And I'm going to cancel this. I've got the battery outside. We don't want that there, do we? I thought I already did that, but that's okay. Uh, yeah, we got to, and that way we can focus a little bit more on cooking. I can use Coburn for other things. He won't need to be doing construction. So Zeif, if we get him, will be construction and crafting. So he will be able to tailor our clothing here, which we're going to need to look into. So I'm just going to slow it down, and we are going to see. As it took, we're going to need to get some of those. Do we need patch leather to do that, though? So we're going to do until we have one. So there's always one in stock for now. That'll do. We'll kind of just set that. So prisoner, we're going to recruit. We're going to set him to recruit as well. We need to be careful. Resistance is only at 12, which is awesome. So, oh no, drift the base resistance 7 to 12. So it could have been better. That's the worst, it's, worst it could be. <laughs> That's okay though. Ben will work on that when he can. He'll do his wardening when it's needed. There you go, Ben's working his magic as a warden here, so he's down to 11.3. This is good, that shouldn't take too long. We will eventually have our fourth character. Oh man, I'm getting proper into this game. The more you kind of understand it, right? It's super cool. I wanted to get a second battery in here. Just looking at de Blasi here, he did eat raw food at the moment. I think he's healthy though. We need to make sure... Why is his bedroom awful? We're going to need to get maybe a plant pot or two then. Uh, let's do that. I know that we're getting a lot in, but I do want to make sure that they are happy. So we're going to go with some plant pots. That isn't always going to be the prison bedroom, by the way. So I'm going to just put in some plant pots in these guys. And de Blasi is actually... Oh no, he's playing. I set that to be moved. I need to reinstall this over here. Let's do that. Right, let's harvest some more of these bushes as well, because they're complaining low food. We may as well stockpile a little bit. We do have a freezer, so there's no harm in that. Get that harvested as well. How's our growth of the spuds doing? 34%, corn's 39%. We do need to get a lot of this before the winter. That's what I'm concerned about, so we are going to need to get some food. And I do want to be able to tame these guys once it's done. This wall needs to come first, though. But it looks like he's got it all in. It's just gonna. He just needs to build... Um, let's have a look at him. His construction's got to be going up. Yeah, it's not great. Goes up pretty slow. We need this guy. This is at 10.4. Ben, I don't know if he needs feeding at any point. We need to focus on foods being priority. So, cooking. Coburn. Although you are constructing right now, it's because we don't need the food. I think I need to set this higher. Oh, we need to hunt more. 
Okay, so we're going to need... Although we got the berries, we can make simple meals from these. Let's grab as many as we can on the harvest then. Kind of important. We're quite lucky that we do have a fair bit to harvest on this map, so it is quite good. And because we got the freezer, I don't mind. So we'll grab all that in and we'll make simple meals with that. I don't want to kill these. I kind of want to tame them because I know you can ride them. Right, there we go. Got a bit sorted there. Oh, he's on his way. Blast it. Please hit it. Or oh, it runs... Ah, oh, run out of the map. Damn it. Yeah, it's kind of strange that they can run out of the map. I'm not used to that, obviously. Uh, I'm not going to bother with the rabbits. Uh, Ibex, Ram, Doe, and Doe. We could probably get rid... We could hunt one of the Does, then. So we got one male, one female on the map. Seven meals in stock, though, so not too bad. We're almost there on the solar panels. We need to decide what we're doing after as well. So 9.8 on the resistance now. It shouldn't take too long, then. Probably, what, six days? I am tempted to uh, move this guy over, actually, and have just a dining room there. I could do with cleaning being done a little bit more. So who's best to probably set that? Maybe Ben for now. Although you are wardening. I think we just need the fourth person at this point. I've just noticed Coburn is recovering from the food poison now, so it is affecting his needs, though he's in serious pain. What happens when we're in a storm here? I know we're going to get more power, but can they get electrocuted like in Alien Dawn? <laughs> I need to know. Oh god, there's fires. Everybody put it out. Go, Ben. Good job. Okay, that happens. Cool. I love the little fire mechanic on this, actually. It's pretty cool. Did he kill the Ibex? I don't think he did. Oh, he's hit it. Bleed out. Right lung destroyed. Surely that can't run with a... Oh, ancient danger. As de Blasi draws near the ancient wall, a sense of foreboding overcomes him. He isn't sure why, but he feels that this dusty structure may contain great danger. So, don't mine into this. There, let's see, there's like compacted machinery. It's kind of good that we didn't grab that in the end then. Cool, there's a bit of steel that compacted steel we shouldn't grab then either. This thing's got to be dying. It's crazy that he's on shooting 13. Strong expert, but he whiffs his shots. I guess the gun makes a difference, right? We need to get hauling done a bit quicker here as well. Uh, mine, cook. The Blasi, hunt, grow, plant, cut. Can you also focus on hauling after that? Although he is, he's on two. Maybe Ben. Yeah, that's cool. Go do it. 8.8 .8 resistance on Zaif now. Zaif? Zaif? Yeah, I'm going to put someone specifically on haul then. So I'm going to actually reduce the grow plant cut stuff now. He's on hunt, so he should go haul. That's all de Blasi does at the moment. That's what we need. Minor break risk. They all look okay to me. Uh, solar panel's done as well. That's awesome. So what we want to do, I'm tempted. I want to get into like long blades and smithing. And then better armor and stuff for these attacks. We are going to need to build that up. Um... Although, is there anything else we want to get before that? Advanced lights? I think we do just focus on the smithing. For now. That way we can create items to sell as well. Just notice this Zyph has a wooden hand. <laughs> and an old gunshot wound, which is annoying on happiness. But that's okay. We've still got our basic um, house here. I think we're going to need some lights in here as well. I need to just get this wall finished. I've got him doing a lot, and he's not the best constructor, so... Kind of just need to let it happen until we get Zyph, because he's going to then move on to construction here. Uh, is he going to be worthy of holding a gun? Nah, we can put it on him, but not necessarily. He's also very good at intellect, but I'm going to have him probably on construction and crafting. And then, yeah, we'll move Coburn on to mining, main melee. Maybe get him hauling. Yeah, he can do all the, the remedial stuff, like hauling and stuff then, if that's the case. I really need to get these weapons inside too, actually. So I'm actually going to just tick this at the moment to get these guys inside before they go bad because they are getting, they are going down. We'll get those guys moved in. I think the, the leather also probably needs to come inside of these. I need to get them built though first. Mad Ibex Doe. Let's have a look. Okay, the Blasi. I get you to... Can I come here? Come over here, mate. Might need to get Coburn ready on this as well. Can you shoot that? Come on, mate. Oh, why? Let's 
stop. I'm going to get him to come knife it as well. Although he did hit it. How do you miss from there? Definitely got to be careful. Get the knife on it as well. We'll just hit it for now. There we go. Cool. Well done, Coburn. Cheers, mate. That's another one we can use, so we'll take that. Yeah, if you know how to get rid of these, I would really, really appreciate that. Please do bear in mind I do record a couple of episodes ahead as well, but I really would like to know how I can bin off those hairs because they're quite annoying. 6.8 resistance on Zafe as well. Oh, they can... They Do they try and break out? Yes, they do. Okay, cool. And there we go. We'll see. Down to 5.9. Well, Ben's really good at that. So I guess the higher your social, the better that is. That's really, really good. I, I rate that. And he's up and about now because he's fully healed. Look. And then we're going to need to work on clothing. Let me check the bill here. Uh, so he's going to move on to crafting once we've got him, actually. So that's we're kind of just waiting for him to do that. And then we'll use all this leather. So we're going to need to... Um, where do we put this? Can you set these for storage? No. It's weird that you can't put clothing in the dresser, I'll be honest with you. Okay, Burn, when you're up and about, mate, can I prioritise you getting all these walls finished, mate, so you can move on to this stuff, please? Well done, mate. I got him quite doing quite a bit at the moment. That's why we actually need this extra person. We have a full battery as well, so I'm comfortable with where we're at at the base at the moment. And there we go. He's actually just started to fly onto some of that as well. I don't know what he's doing up at night here. Let's check De Blasi as well. He doesn't look the happiest. Need to remember some needs. Slept in heat. Heat stroke? Not even that hot. Oh, indoors is pretty hot. Okay, we're going to need some kind of coolant area on this then. We need the air cons maybe an event. Maybe an air con here and then a vent going through. That's a good idea. Right, let's look into that then. So temperature. We get a vent like so installed on these guys although let's cancel that because that will make them all prisons actually i made this mistake on my practicing wait until this guy's done he's gone back to bed ben hammering it good effort mate all right we got one of these built now so this is going to be specifically weapons and apparel then i've got both of these on that let's uh, i think i put that on here so we're going to take that off that one weapons and apparel are going to go on this uh, shelf here and he is hauling, which is awesome. We'll get all this stuff in. How are we doing on foods? we got a bit of spare there. we got the 10 meals. Let's continue to harvest where we can as well. Keep that going. Med stuff. Anything we can kind of sell, really. This rain's going to help the growth. So hopefully we can get a batch of these before we get into the uh, thingy. We are still in the summer, so it should be okay. Oh my god, what the hell happened? What the hell? A fault in electric conduit has caused a short circuit. All 586 WD of energy in the connected batteries has been discharged. Oh god, we lost all of that. Right, we're okay though, we managed to put it out. But that is... Yeah, that's annoying. Maybe we move the batteries away. Is that because he's built it poor, actually? I wonder if that's the case. No, you don't have that on these pipes. This is why you need the fire foams and things. How are we doing here? Look at this, 3.9. We've almost got Zaif joining us. I'm excited for that. That's going to be really, really good. The wall has finished on this end as well, so we are safe now from this end. Gives us a bit more time if they need to run around and get to us. Now, it's a little bit dark, but I think what we're going to do is focus on getting this storage room done. The Coburn should go and do that anyway. And then once this little area has been built, we should be able to look at taming probably these guys. We'll use those for, for food. Let's get that one harvested. Wow, it really is dark when it goes dark, isn't it? Oh, we have a prison break. All right, Zyf prisoners are more likely to attempt breakout when there are numer uh, they are numerous and healthy. So we got a bit of a prison break here. Coburn, do you want to go and like stab him up? Beat him up. Can I get you to melee attack Zyf here, please? Don't know how he's getting out, but go punch him up a bit, De Blasi. If you can, good effort, mate. Oh, yeah, I think de Blasi's going to knock him out, hopefully. Yep, there we go. We'll undraft you. Ben, can you... Oh, he's dead! No! He murdered him with his fists. Oh, that is annoying. No, de Blasi, you absolute animal. Oh, no, he's too strong. He was punching him with fists as well. That's annoying. All that hard work, eh? 
We'll keep that as a prisoner bed for now then. We'll, we'll grab someone else in. He was a good character too. That's annoying. We're so close to breaking him too. Well, I guess that happens. News to me, but there we go. But guys, that's going to be where we end this one out. So as always, if you have enjoyed, smash that thumbs up for me. Keep the tips coming. It really, really is appreciated. And uh, as always, take it easy. I'll see you in the next one.